Well then, welcome back guys once again to some more Mad Max. Apparently, like uh, that guy said, we're supposed to go get this murderous female and have her tag along with us and she's going to be our racing partner. I'm not sure how uh, safe that sounds, but we will go and do it anyways. This must be her. I need a fighter. What oh, is my sucker to say to me? You want to fight me? No, I need a fighter. Someone to partner up for the Gastown races. <laughs> oh, races. The taste of blood on your lips. Your own. Someone else's. It don't matter. You're alive while death is all around. Do you want to join me? Yeah. If you do something for me first. <laughs> Square my dad with crow dazzle, and I swear I'll get sober and murder up with you. Mm -hmm. Wow, what the hell is that girl on? Whatever we can do to get her off it, I think we probably should. Let's go talk to Crow Dazzle, see if he can be of any help. Although, I'm not really in the mood to pay off someone else's debt. Tenderloin's debt. Ha! That's her deal? A crafty fume head she is. Crow can lift a wing and wipe the slate clean. But my charity ain't free. State your wish. Low down as such. You race for Crow, here, now. You bring the chills, and the spills, and the people drop bills? I let her debt slide. Fine. Not so fast, Buck. You ain't racing that funky junk here. That rubber ain't fit for my finery. Only speed demons on this track. You tune that car right, then you race my blacktop. Can't race until the car's faster. Yes, 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 faster, faster I can do, but I need parts. Then we go get them. All right, yeah, I mean a V8 engine, I'm sure that would be fine, because we're stuck on V6 right now. But I mean, other than that, our car seems pretty fast as it is. Yeah, the Wild Hunt, if you don't remember, that was one of the car body choices we had towards the beginning. It actually was going to be my second choice, but I thought this looked just a little bit better. But yeah, we'll head over and try to grab that thing. See? The smoke! That is where we shall find the hole they call Wild Hunt! How'd you hear about it? From rumors and, and mumbling, all town keeps his ear to the ground. <laughs> ear to the ground. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this uh, Wild... What the hell was that? Oh, it's a minefield. But yeah, as I was saying, I'm pretty sure that Wild Hunt body kit, that's the same one that Max has on his Interceptor. And that's kind of the main reason I didn't end up choosing it at the beginning, because I kind of wanted something a little bit different, since I think we will fight for it at the end. But I'm going to let Chum repair this. I'll head up and grab the body kit myself. Oh yeah, this thing must be something special, at least to these guys. But yeah, if you did notice, we did have to kind of downgrade our car. I'm pretty sure it was to kind of meet the uh, the racing specifications for Crow Dazzle. He didn't want us killing anyone. Plus, I think if you take some of the armor off and whatnot, it does make your car just a tad bit faster. But yeah, here's the body kit, so let's go grab this. Or you know what? Let's take the scraps first. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure how we're going to get it down. Maybe Chum knows a special way up. Who knows? Okay, sweet. Body kit unlocked. Let's go put the bad boy on. Well, here she is, the speed demon, and I gotta admit, it does not look that bad at all. Of course, we did have to kind of take off all the armor, so... Probably shouldn't get in any fights on the way there, but I think we should be pretty damn fast. Yeah, it really is crazy how much faster this thing is than our previous car, because we actually had to downgrade the engine for this one. But I think just by taking off all that armor... It really helps, so as you can tell, it's a lot riskier driving around because you're so much easier to kill, but sometimes being faster is really all you need to stay alive in this place. 
So yeah, hopefully Crow Dazzle's happy with us. I don't see why he wouldn't be. Okay, so let's see. We can do the Barrel Bash or the Opus Wars. I'm pretty sure we do need to do the Barrel Bash for this one. And then we'll use the Speed Demon. Oh, those other ones look kind of cool, don't they? The 12 and the Tough Nut. Um, sir? Thanks for repairing my car and all, but you're about to get run over. That was close. That there was one brave dude, but yeah, apparently... Everything in these races is entirely legal, so if we wanted to, we could just pull out our shotgun and kill everyone. Or even use our harpoon. In fact, let's try that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's out of the race now. But yeah, just like that, we have taken the lead. This thing might not be too hard after all. But judging by that first checkpoint, I think all we have to do is kind of run into the barrels. And we should be good. And watch out for rocks along the way. Uh-oh. We have been passed. These guys have so much armor, though. I just, I feel like they're not going to be too effective. Yeah, look at that. Just passed in a matter of seconds. Oh, I think... Yeah, we can take this. Pretty sure we're not missing any barrels. Oh, man. Yeah, we're so far ahead of them, this is almost not going to be very fun. Oh, that might slow them down. As if they weren't slow enough already. Okay, let's see. Oh, man. Well, this is cool. I was about to say, I wish there was like some random encounters. But this is kind of what I was talking about. Like if maybe an enemy convoy came and attacked us while we were midway through the race, that would be awesome. So is that it? Is that all the checkpoints? Looks like it. We'll head back to the finish line then. Yeah, that was way too easy. I don't know why... What's his name? Crowdash wouldn't just let us use our normal car. I think it would have been a bit more fun if it was a little more challenging. Although it does look like we have to beat that timer still. So we have a minute to get back. I'm not sure how far away this place is, though. I think we'll do just fine. Yeah, I mean, look, it's right here. This is far too easy. Okay, let's see. Barrel Bash complete. Oh, and we got Legendary? That's pretty awesome. So now where to? Revert the Magnum Opus back to the previous setup? Yeah, why not? Oh, it's the same damn thing. Yeah, as long as she doesn't kill us first. Yeah, on my way over here, I went ahead and put all our upgrades back on the car, and as cool as it looks, it's almost a, a pain to drive now just because it's so much slower, as you may have noticed. The good news is I did purchase another boost upgrade, so we do have four of those in case things do get rough and we kind of need to speed things up. But yeah, I'm almost tempted to kind of take some of the armor off just so we can go a little bit faster, or at least hurry up and get one of these new engines, because that could help as well. But yeah, it looks like we are here, so let's go see... I'm not sure if right now we're talking to Crowdazzle again, or if we're going back to the chick. I think we're going to go ahead and talk to the girl. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think when we go do the race at Gastown, we're definitely going to need to remove some of that armor. If we want to go fast, that is. Okay. Let's see what else she needs. Your debt is paid. Yeah, I'm kind of certain she's not going to be too much help to us. 
We'll see, though. Well, sure, I get the point of the fighter. Oh, but you will. You will, huh? My black fingers and bent form leave me out. I've not the skill for the kill. <laughs> It'll be just you and Tenderloin on the Oval of Death. If the card takes damage, I doubt she'll know what to do. It won't matter, Saint. Uh -uh. You'll triumph. You must. Yeah, so that's kind of an interesting twist. Since we don't have Chum Bucket, we're not going to really be able to fix up the car unless maybe max has a few tricks up his sleeve but who knows now it turns out let's see pink eye has another wasteland mission for us okay g doesn't but gash does so we could either do those although i'm kind of excited to go do the uh, the gas town race so i think instead we'll head over there and take care of that all right so we made it to gas town i did do a little bit of tweaking on the car i took off some of the uh, the extra stuff like the ramming thing on the front I figured that would only slow us down. I did have to keep a little bit of armor on because I think this race might be a little more dangerous. But hopefully what I did, it kind of works out. And yeah, we'll give it a shot. Now we just got to enter in. Champion's fortune and his life can be fleeting, but tonight there shall be a reckoning for your benefit and his own. A daring warrior has issued a challenge. Man, this thing was rigged from the start. All right, sounds good. I'm thinking to start this thing off, we might as well just ignore a lot of these little guys. We'll go straight for Stankum. Plus, if we end up leaving these guys alive when he drops the mines, they might be able to take some of the hits for us. Oh man. Yeah, he's really not trying to let us pass him, is he? In fact, I think this is almost more of a fight to the death than a uh, race. 
because it doesn't look like there's any finish line we have to cross. It's kind of all about killing him. At least before our bomb blows up. Oh, not more of them. Okay, it's just us and him now. There we go. Let's try one more. Nice. We've almost got him down. Oh man, there are just traps everywhere, aren't there? Come on. Oh yeah, those little guys, they're just annoying, aren't they? But yeah, I figured it might be kind of fun to try first person out for this race since we did use third for the other one. It's a bit more immersive too. But yeah, as big as his car is, he sure is moving, isn't he? We got a little bit of catching up to do. Can we hit him? There we go. Oh no, we missed, didn't we? Shoot. Okay, come on. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, it's kind of a bit unfortunate not being able to have Chum. Because he would have been able to uh, repair our car if we needed him to. The chick we have right now can't really do that. Okay, come on, come on. Oh yeah, look at that. That's one lap down, so there's definitely no sort of finish line. It's all about us trying to kill him. We've only got five minutes left to do so. Yeah, I think if we can just get past all these little guys, we might have a shot at him. Oh, man. Did we end up hitting that thing? I couldn't really tell. I think we took a little bit of damage. Okay, nice. We got him in our sights again. There we go. A few more hits and we should have him down. Oh boy. Yeah, a few more hits and we might go down ourselves. Things are not looking too great. Okay, let's try to hit him one last time. There we go. I think that's it, isn't it? Perfect.